Avogadro's law states that at constant temperature and pressure, volume and number of moles of a gas are directly proportional, which means that as the number of moles increases, the volume will increase, and as the number of moles decreases, the volume will decrease. And this is clear, because if you have more particles, for sure you're going to have more volume. Avogadro's law also states that equal volume of gases contain the same number of particles, which means that if you have two different gases with the same volume, at constant temperature and pressure, for sure they're going to have the same number of particles. So the ratio of the volume by the number of moles is always constant, and V1 over N1 equal to V2 over N2. Initial volume divided by number of moles initial equal to final volume divided by the final number of moles. And now I will solve an exercise about Avogadro's law. Six moles of helium in a five liters flexible container. More gas is pumped into the container until it reaches a volume of 12 liters. While the pressure and temperature of the gas remain constant, calculate the number of moles of helium added to the container. We start by writing the given number of moles initial six moles volume initial 5 liters final volume is 12 liters and just calculate the final number of moles we write the formula v1 over n1 equal to v2 over n2 then n2 it's equal to n1 v2 over v1 we replace the variables by their values we cancel the similar units between numerators and denominators then we find the answer the final number of moles is going to be equal 14.4 moles so now to find the number of moles added we should deduct the number of moles initial from the final number of moles so 14.4 moles minus 6 moles the number of moles added is going to be 8.4 moles